What if I told you that right now, as you're watching this video, two mysterious objects are racing through space in perfect alignment with Earth, and one of them just appeared out of nowhere? You've probably heard about 3i Atlas, the interstellar visitor that's been baffling scientists for months. But did you know that a second object has just materialized in almost the exact same location? Both objects are doing something that should be impossible. They're brightening near the sun, but showing no visible tails. An amateur astronomer discovered uh, an object uh, near the sun. is actually barely bound to the sun, so it's almost interstellar. Uh, most likely it came from the outskirts of the solar system. What are the odds that two anomalous objects would appear in our solar system at the same time? displaying identical, mysterious behavior? By the end of this video, you'll understand why astronomers are calling this the most significant cosmic event of our generation. This newcomer, designated C-2025 V1 Borisov, was discovered by the same astronomer who found the second ever confirmed interstellar object, and it's displaying the exact same puzzling characteristic that has made 3i Atlas so controversial. No visible tail. Even more unsettling, this object materialized at the precise moment when 3i Atlas was being bombarded by massive solar storms. Almost as if the universe is running some kind of cosmic simulation to test our preparedness for something we've never encountered before. Subscribe to Space Aquarius and let's begin. Right now, as you're watching this video, two tailless objects are cutting through space in nearly perfect alignment with Earth, and one of them might not be what it appears to be. Let me paint you the picture of what we're dealing with here. V1 Borisov sits roughly 64 million miles from Earth. That's about two-thirds the distance to the Sun. It's positioned almost directly between us and 3i Atlas, creating what scientists are calling a cosmic alignment that occurs maybe once in a lifetime. But here's where things get really interesting. This object was first spotted on November 3rd, 2025, shooting up from below what we call the ecliptic plane. Imagine a flat disk where most planets orbit the Sun. Borisov came from underneath this disk and is now arcing over it, heading for its closest approach to the Sun on November 16th at just under 46 million miles out. Now you might be thinking, so what? Comets do this all the time. But that's exactly the problem. Borisov isn't acting like a normal comet. When astronomers point their telescopes at it, they see a compact, fuzzy ball called a coma. That's the cloud of gas and dust that forms around a comet's nucleus when it gets heated by the sun. But what they're not seeing is the one thing that makes a comet instantly recognizable. A tail. Out of 10 separate observations recorded in the official astronomical database, only two observers reported seeing any kind of tail at all. And even those reports are inconsistent. One measured the tail at 50 arc seconds long, while another measured it at 72 arc seconds. For context, that's like trying to spot a dime from half a mile away. Most professional astronomers with high quality equipment are seeing absolutely nothing. This puts Borisov in the same category as 3i Atlas, the interstellar visitor that has been baffling scientists since its discovery. Both objects are showing strong activity. They're brightening as they approach the sun, which means something is definitely happening on their surfaces. But neither one is producing the dramatic dust tail that should be streaming behind them, like a cosmic banner. Let's talk about what makes this timing so remarkable. 3i Atlas just survived what can only be described as a solar bombardment. Starting on October 21st, massive sunspots on the sun's surface began unleashing a series of solar flares and coronal mass ejections directly at the interstellar object. These are essentially billion-ton bullets of superheated plasma traveling at millions of miles per hour. For any normal comet, this would be like getting hit by a cosmic blowtorch. The intense radiation and solar wind should have vaporized surface materials, creating spectacular jets of gas and dust that would form a tail visible from Earth. Instead, 3i Atlas emerged from this solar storm, looking essentially unchanged. Brighter than expected, but still completely tailless. And now, just as 3i Atlas is recovering from this cosmic beating, Borisov appears in almost the exact same region of space, displaying the exact same mysterious behavior. Here's what's really got scientists talking, Borisov's orbit. According to the latest calculations from NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, 
This object has an eccentricity of 1.00958. Now, that number might not mean much to you, but it's crucial. An eccentricity of exactly 1.0 means a perfect parabolic orbit. The object comes in from deep space, swings around the sun once and heads back out forever. Anything above 1.0 means it's hyperbolic, moving so fast it's not bound to our solar system at all. Borisov's number is just barely above 1.0, which technically classifies it as a long-period comet from our own solar system, probably originating from the Oort cloud, that spherical shell of icy objects that surrounds our solar system, at distances up to 100,000 times farther than Earth, is from the Sun. But here's the troubling part, that orbital calculation could change. As astronomers gather more observations over the coming weeks, they might find that Borisov is actually moving faster than initially thought, which would push its eccentricity definitively above 1.0 and reclassify it as interstellar. The man who discovered this object is Gennady Borisov, a Crimean astronomer who has a track record that should make us pay attention. He's the same person who discovered 2i Borisov back in 2019, the second confirmed interstellar object ever observed. The first was Oumuamua in 2017, which caused its own controversy when it showed unexplained acceleration as it left our solar system. So we have an astronomer with a proven ability to spot interstellar visitors discovering another mysterious object that's behaving exactly like the current interstellar visitor that's already puzzling scientists. The odds of this being pure coincidence are astronomically small. Let's examine what we know about 3i Atlas to understand why Borisov's similar behavior is so significant. This interstellar object has been defying expectations since its discovery. It's currently shining at magnitude 9.8, which makes it about 2.5 times brighter than astronomers predicted based on standard comet models. When scientists analyzed its light curve, basically a graph showing how its brightness changes over time, they found something unprecedented. Starting in early September, 3i Atlas began brightening much faster than any normal comet should. The rate of brightening was seven times steeper than what you'd expect from a typical icy body approaching the sun. Even more puzzling, observers using solar coronagraphs, specialized instruments that block out the sun's glare, noticed that 3i Atlas appeared distinctly blue in their images. This is highly unusual because most comets appear yellowish or reddish due to sunlight reflecting off dust particles. A persistent blue color typically indicates glowing gas emissions, not simple reflection. Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb has been analyzing these anomalies and asking uncomfortable questions. If 3i Atlas is brightening due to normal outgassing, the process where solar heating vaporizes ice and creates jets of material, then by the laws of physics it should be losing a significant amount of mass. Loeb's calculations suggest the object would have a half-life of about six months at its current rate of activity. That means it should be shedding enough material to create a vast, glowing plume of gas and dust that would be easily visible to our most powerful telescopes. The European Space Agency's JUICE spacecraft, currently positioned favorably to observe the object, should be able to detect such a plume. Later this December, when 3i Atlas makes its closest approach to Earth at about 17 million miles, hundreds of ground-based telescopes, plus the Hubble and James Webb Space Telescopes, will have their chance to look for this predicted mass loss. If they don't see it, then something else must be driving the object's unusual behavior. Now, back to Borisov. This new object is currently hovering around magnitude 13, which means you'd need a medium-sized telescope to spot it. It's expected to brighten as it approaches the sun, but so far it's not showing the dramatic increase in brightness that 3i Atlas displayed. What's particularly intriguing is Borisov's trajectory. It's coming in from below the ecliptic plane at a steep angle of 112.7 degrees. For comparison, most comets from our solar system's Oort cloud approach at much shallower angles. This steep inclination is more typical of interstellar objects, which can approach from any direction since they're not bound by our solar system's original formation disk. The object will reach its closest point to the sun on November 16th, at a distance of about 43 million miles, well within the orbit of Mercury. If it's a normal comet, this close solar encounter should definitely produce a visible tail as ice sublimates and creates jets of material. 
but if Borisov continues to behave like three eye atlas, brightening without producing a significant tail, then we'll have two mysterious objects in our solar system displaying the same anomalous characteristics. There's another factor that makes the situation even more remarkable, the solar activity. Right now, our sun is experiencing a period of intense magnetic activity. The same sunspot regions that bombarded 3I Atlas are continuing to produce major solar flares. We've recently experienced G3-class geomagnetic storms. That's the strong category on a scale that goes from minor to extreme. These solar storms are expected to continue and possibly intensify as Borisov approaches its perihelion. If this object is indeed a normal comet, the increased solar radiation and particle bombardment should trigger spectacular outgassing and tail formation. If it doesn't, we'll have even more evidence that something unusual is happening in our cosmic neighborhood. Whether you buy into that interpretation or not, the facts remain. We have two objects displaying similar unusual behavior, discovered by astronomers with proven track records of finding interstellar visitors, appearing in our solar system during a period of intense solar activity. The next few weeks could be the turning point in understanding what we're dealing with. As Borisov approaches the Sun and 3I Atlas continues its outbound journey, telescopes around the world will be watching for any changes in their behavior. The Chinese Space Agency has already released low-resolution images of 3I Atlas taken by their Tianwen probe orbiting Mars, though the quality is too poor to reveal much detail. More importantly, NASA has promised to release high-resolution images of 3I Atlas, taken by the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter's high-rise camera, as soon as the current government shutdown ends. These images could finally give us a clear view of the object's surface and help determine its composition and structure. What we're witnessing might be the most significant astronomical event of our generation. Two mysterious objects challenging our understanding of how comets behave, appearing in our solar system at the same time and forcing us to confront the possibility that not everything out there follows the rules we think we understand. The story of V1 Borisov and 3I Atlas is still being written, and the next chapter could change everything we thought we knew about our place in the cosmos. If you found this cosmic mystery as fascinating as I did, smash that like button and subscribe to never miss an update on these developing stories. Drop a comment below with your thoughts on what these objects might really be, and share this video with anyone who loves space mysteries as much as you do. The universe is full of surprises, and we're just getting started uncovering them.